Hi, welcome back to Michaela Vapes, and today we're going to be doing a review on OFE Old Fashioned Elixir. Uh, before I begin the review today, I would like to remind everyone that the FDA is trying to ban 99% of all vaping products on the market at this time. Uh, a lot of things have been going on, um, but one thing has remained the same, and that is that we all must fight for our rights to vape. Uh, I'm asking everyone to please uh, contact your representatives in Congress and ask them to uh, support H.R. 2058 and the Cole Bishop Amendment. Uh, joint advocacy groups. Uh, I'll put the links in the description box below. But the bottom line is that we all need to fight for our right to vape. And in OFE's line, there are four. And I'll go ahead and show you the bottle. They are very, very nice. They are child restraint caps. They are a nice amber color. And they have on there... Uh, the name, the milligrams, uh, what it is, they have on their ingredients, and they have on their Proposition 65 warning. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I'm going to be doing this review today on my Segele 150 with my Mephesto, and I've already dripped uh, apple pie. Well, let me back up, sorry. Um, OFE can be found on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram and I will put their web addresses in the description box below as well um, I will be reviewing their Main Street line and there are four in that line <clears throat> and uh, let me see they come in 0 1.5 3 6 12 and 18 milligram Nick they are available in 15 or 30 ml bottles they are 70 VG 30 PG for a 15 mil bottle, it is $8.99, and for their 30 mil bottles, they are $14.99. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start with their apple pie, and I've already dripped that on my Mephesto. And on their website for apple pie, it says, Freshly picked apples blended with sweet cinnamon, savory spices, and a touch of buttery crust to deliver classic American apple pie like Grandma used to make. And I'm going to go ahead and take a hit on this one, and I'll tell you what I get from their apple pie. I get a very, very nice uh, apple. Um, I don't taste any cinnamon. I do get some spices. It just, it really does taste like uh, apple pie your grandma used to make when you were a child. Um, I definitely get the buttery crust. It, the only thing that I do not get from the description is I do not get any cinnamon. As you can see, the claw production is awesome. And it is a very, very good, good apple pie. Okay, and the next one that I'm going to be reviewing, and I'm not going to be showing you all the bottles because they're all the same. The only difference is uh, the name of the e-liquid in the bottle. The next one I'm going to be doing is Peach Cobbler, and on their website it says, Decadent Cobbler with Creamy Vanilla and Cinnamon on the Inhale, combined with Juicy Peach on the Exhale to deliver this Southern Classic. And I'm going to shake this up. And I'm going to drip a little bit on my Mephesto, and I'll tell you what we get from OFE's Peach Cobbler. Mmm, I can smell the peach instant. Oh, it smells so good. Excuse me. I haven't been feeling well, so if I'm coughing and hacking in these reviews, I sincerely apologize. Oh, you definitely get a sweet peach. You 
Yes, I get a sweet peach with uh, vanilla following that. Once again, I do not taste any cinnamon. Um, but it de definitely does taste like a peach cobbler. That's making my mouth water taste so realistic. Excuse me. <coughs> okay, and the next one that I'm going to be reviewing in this line is Lemonberry. And Lemonberry, on their website, it says, Refreshing tart lemon mingled with a sweet melody of berries for a refreshing all-day treat like a cool glass of berry lemonade on a summer's day. And we'll go ahead and shake up lemonberry. <coughs> and I'll drip a couple drops, drops, not drip drops anymore. I'll drip some on the Mephisto. And I'll tell you what we get from lemonberry. Ah, oh, definitely taste, uh, taste, definitely smell the lemon. Oh, this is refreshing. I definitely can taste uh, lemon. It's it's not sweet, but <coughs> excuse me, it's it's not a boom bam in your face lemon. Definitely, um, and the exhale is sweet berries. It's a very, very, very refreshing uh, berry lemonade. Okay, and on to their last one is Cup O Joe. On their website, it says perfectly roasted, rich coffee served with a hint of luxurious cream and just a touch of sweetness to start your day off right and keep you going all day. Go ahead and let me shake this up. <coughs> And I'll drip some on the Mephesto. And I'll tell you what I get from Cup O Joe. Okay. I definitely, definitely get coffee uh, right away. And it's like a deep roast. Um, it, it doesn't taste like a Starbucks coffee. Um, it's mainly coffee with uh, just a little dabble of cream and a little dollop of sugar. It's very, very good. Um, but if you're looking for a sweet cream uh, coffee, this would not be the one. If you're looking for a robust coffee with just a dollop of this and a dollop of that, this you would love this one. Okay, that's all I have for this review, and I would like to thank OFE for sending me these e-liquids for the purpose of this review, and I apologize for not getting it out sooner. And on that note, I'm going to go ahead and take a hit and ask you to please, please stand up for your rights to vape. If you want to see reviews and you want to know kind of what the flavor t uh, flavors are, what they taste like, I know taste is subjective. But it kind of helps, you know, you learn someone, you know, what they like and you kind of can go off 
if you would like those flavors or not. So please, please, please stand up for your rights to vape. And on that note, I'm going to take a hit of Couple Joe, and I'll see you on the next one.